right, YouTube, what's going on? Today I've got the best build for the Diamantes in Warzone. Now, if you like me and don't like videos that take eight light years to get to the point, do consider dropping a sub and liking the video. I've got a ton planned for 2021, but let's dive right into this build. So to start off, we're gonna be using the Agency Suppressor for sound suppression and damage range. The barrel we used in the last one for the most damage and effective damage range, including bullet velocity in there. The laser is the one with the most hip fire accuracy because we are going to be using dual wield on these things because they do a ton of damage. And finally, for the ammo, we're using the last one for the most amount of ammo and reload speed. Now I'm gonna up open this in Cold War because I wanna show you the actual stats for these attachments. So the suppressor is kind of standard, but this barrel gives you plus 13 damage, 40% damage range, and 120% bullet velocity. And the cons, we really don't care about because this thing is dual weld and we're not aim aiming down sights. This barrel is the best out of all of them. There's no comparison to it. The body, we're using the five milliwatt laser because it gives you plus 35 hip fire accuracy compared to the last one, which only gives you plus 25. There's no point in having the last laser when you can use the one with more hip fire accuracy. And then for the mag, uh, this one, self-explanatory. We're just using the one with the most amount of damage, ammo capacity, and reload quickness. It is pretty straightforward from there. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is the build that I have for you for the Diamantes in Warzone. I know Tim put a video out on his YouTube today about these guns. They are absolutely disgusting close range, and they actually do pretty good at a distance that you'll see from some of the clips here. The one positive that I like the most about these dual pistols, not only is that they're a burst, but you also can run Ghost in Warzone in this because heartbeats are used by every single person and UAVs and Ghost as well. This gun holds up against close range and medium range. As you can see there, I got some bullets flying at the guy and melts them right up close. The guy had full health and didn't stand a chance. It's really good at taking care of teams when you're in close quarters. And it's a very good gun. I'm going to keep using this thing. So anyways, dream big. Peace out. See y'all in the next one. Have a good holiday.